I shouldn't be talking about this to an outsider. You wouldn't understand. I suppose there's no harm in it. It's not like you can help me. I've been an apprentice for too long. To become a true hunter, I must bring back the pelt of the beast I killed myself. A boar or a wolf or something. I wanted to hunt in the forest, but we're forbidden to enter because of the attack. But the real problem is Gaina. She's my heart's desire. I have asked for her hand, but she cruelly refuses it. She will not bond with an apprentice, she says, and calls me a child. I am no child. If I was a hunter, I could prove it, but I cannot hunt, and... and Gaina will never bond with me. I feel so helpless. I shouldn't have brought it up. Just leave me to my misery. You think I haven't thought about this? There's nothing I can do. No, I, I couldn't do that. I must kill the beast myself. It is my rite of passage to become a full hunter. I suppose you could, but what good would that do? The situation hasn't changed. Really? I... I'm willing to try anything. Siranas. Oh, ma Siranas. I will pray to the goddess of love that you are successful. Greetings once again. You spoke to him? What did he say? Oh. I don't expect an outsider to understand our ways, but... I just can't bond with Kamen. He's been a hunter apprentice for over two years now, and he's yet to slay a proper beast. Each time he's tried, something has gone wrong. Perhaps the creators do not wish us to bond. I cannot bond with an apprentice hunter, can I? But what if he never becomes a proper hunter? What will become of our family? Oh, you are right! I have made poor Kamen miserable! No wonder he cannot complete his hunt! Masiranas, thank you. You have helped me put this into perspective. I will go and speak to Kamen. Kamen, I have been a fool! Gaina? Wh what do you mean? Have you changed your mind? I have. The Outsider has helped me to see that I was wrong. I have made you miserable, and I should not have. But what about my hunt? I don't care about that. I know you will pass your hunt in time, and we will be happy. Us and our children. Thank you, Gaina. You've made me a happy man. I feel blessed by the gods today. We are both very grateful for the part you've played in bringing us together. How marvelous you are. I am so happy. This is so wonderful. Young love allowed to flourish. Does anyone else feel the urge to vomit? No? Tis just me? Here, take this. It's been in my family for a very long time, but... I hope it plays some part in your battle against the Darkspawn. It's the very least we could do. your pardon, stranger. I was so busy attending to the Hala, I did not hear your approach. My name is Alora. I am the Master Herder in charge of caring for the Hala. Not as exciting as being a Grey Warden, but the Hala are vital to us. They are the noble beasts that pull our Aravel, what humans call land ships. They are our companions and our guides. 
We ride the Hala, but never with reins or a saddle. It is the Hala who decide where to lead us, and our privilege that they take our Aravel with them. In return, it's the herder's job to speak to the Hala and care for their needs. It's a bond of friendship, and not servitude. I fear she may have been bitten during the werewolf attack. I have tried speaking with her, but she is too agitated for me to understand. The curse would not affect her as it would us, but it would still be lethal. And it may prove contagious to the other Hala as well. I can find no wound on her, but if she's truly ill, then... Then I will have to put her out of her misery, for her sake as well as that of the others. I wish I could calm her enough to speak with her. We have lost so many of our hunters. I would hate to lose one of our Hala as well. I don't know. Do you have any skills that might help her? If you do, I would be grateful. She's calming down. That's it, love. Be calm. Tell me what troubles you. Ah, I see. It is her life mate who is sick, not her. He was bitten on the leg during the attack, and she fears greatly for him. I did not realize another hollow was injured. This will allow me to prevent the sickness from spreading to the entire herd. Masiranus, thank you. You have done my clan a great boon this day. I will always be grateful for your help. Very well. shall be done. They say the veil is thin here, and all manner of strange things may be seen. Oh, 
shall do it. shall be done. The Watch Wolves have spoken truly, my brothers and sisters. The Dalish and the human of all things to repay us for our attack, to put us in our place. What bitter irony. You speak to Swift Runner. I lead my cursed brothers and sisters. Turn back now. Go back to the Dalish and tell them that you have failed. Tell them we will gladly watch them suffer the same curse we have suffered for too long. We will watch them pay. You think we would help you find the Great Wolf? You think we would let you kill him? Then you are a fool. Hey, come brothers and sisters! Swift Runner calls you to battle! Drive this invader from our midst! <laughs> Enough! The forest has eyes of its own, and it shall deal with you. You have been warned. Very well. I'll do it.
It shall be done. I shall do it. Who, ah, uh, who comes? We were sent to find Witherfang, bring his heart, attacked. I... And there in a Titian, Grey Warden. Our scouts saw you approaching and tell me you carry the body of one of our hunters with you. Ah, Dagon. He is wounded, but I think he will live. I'm glad we were able to help him. Thank the Maker we returned to the Dalish in time. He must have watched over this man. Or perhaps his own gods were watching out for him. And perhaps they just know the Maker by another name. Believe what you wish. It seems to me that they should be thanking the Grey Warden more than some absent god. But who am I to judge? Ma Sirenas, your help is appreciated. Come, Letheline, let us take Dagon to the Keeper, and quickly. If we are lucky, we may still save him. I shall do it. Right. You've made some important enemies with your little arrows. You're through. <laughs> 